Novak Djokovic is hoping to return to the Australian Open in 2023 after missing out last year. Novak Djokovic has signed up for the World Tennis League event in Dubai, ahead of the Australian Open in January. Djokovic was unable to defend his title in Melbourne at the beginning of this year due to his COVID vaccination status. The saga was one of the most remarkable in tennis history, with the Serbian star finally being deported from Melbourne due to his lack of vaccination and visa issues. Whether Djokovic returns in 2023 remains to be seen, however fans of the former world number one have been given some hope. This comes after it was announced that he would be competing in Dubai at the end of this year, with tournaments in the Middle East often used by players, including Djokovic, to build up match fitness heading into the opening Grand Slam event of the season. The World Tennis League confirmed the news on social media. They wrote. We proudly announce one of the greatest players to have played the game, a joker Noel, will be finishing his 2022 season in Dubai this year at the World Tennis League. Catch the action in person as Novak Djokovic dazzles the court with his game. Speaking about his excitement to return to Dubai, Djokovic himself said, This new event is exciting, there's no doubt about it. I absolutely love playing in Dubai, I've had a lot of success there over the years and really enjoy the fans. This is something different, and it's going to be great being a part of it. Unsurprisingly though, the saga surrounding Djokovic and competing in Australia has reignited. This comes after the Serbian's coach Gorni Venisvic confirmed the world number seven still will not be getting vaccinated despite the drama earlier this year, once again leaving his fate in the hands of the Australian government. The Croat told Jatarnji List, since nothing has changed in his thoughts on the vaccine. It remains to be seen what and how the Australians will decide. The good news for Djokovic is that the government who deported him nine months ago have since lost power. However current Home Affairs Minister Claire O'Neill is still less than keen to allow the tennis star into the country. She also told ABC Radio, why should Novak Djokovic be allowed back into the country simply because he's a high-ranking tennis player with many millions of dollars? It shouldn't be just one rule for him, and a different rule for everyone else. 